Hi, and welcome to my channel. Today I want to talk about the television series Karen Peary, starring Lauren Lyle, and currently streaming on Amazon. This uh, series is based on a number of books written by Val McDermott. Karen Peary is a detective sergeant with uh, Police Scotland. Uh, she's quite young and fairly inexperienced, and she's been assigned to a decades-old cold case, uh, which had recently got some new attention because of a podcast. And in that podcast, uh, Police Scotland is being accused of ignoring the victim because she was a young woman, uh, out alone at night, and they were very sexist, etc., etc. So Karen Peary is assigned not for her detective skills, but because she's a woman, uh, in the hopes that that kind of criticism about sexism and, and biases will uh, will go away. What they hadn't counted on was that uh, Peary is in fact a very dedicated and dogged uh, detective, and along with her uh, her young uh, sidekick Murray, they start kicking over some very old stones and, and upsetting people along the way. I found this series very uh, very well done, actually. I did have some uh, some initial problems with uh, first of all the the Scottish accent, and although it's it's somewhat mild um, compared to a real brogue, I guess is the proper term. Um, it still took a couple of minutes, at least, to uh, to get into the rhythm of things. Once I got it, it was all good. The other is that the uh, the actress portraying um, Karen Peary is very young. Uh, a detective sergeant can be young, but she would necessarily have a couple of years at least in uniform behind her, uh, as well as a couple of years as a detective constable. Um, Lauren Lyle looks like she's barely got high school behind her. However, the story's good enough that, uh, you know, that's a minor niggle and it soon clips along and, and all, all is well. Uh, the series flips back and forth between modern day and 27 years ago when the murder took place. Uh, different actors portray the characters in their respective periods, and they do quite a good job. Some of the modern day characters or actors weren't as well cast as they could have been. Um, but hey, you know, I don't, uh, I'm nothing like I was 27 years ago, so I, I'm not gonna, uh, I'm not gonna criticize that too, too much. Overall, I really enjoyed this series. Uh, each episode is, is 90 minutes, which is a format I haven't seen for a long, long time. Uh, I don't know if this is something that's coming back or if it's unique to, um, this was produced by, uh, ITV in the UK, so whether that's something that uh, they do more frequently over there, I'm not familiar. Um, but it's uh, it's certainly not an issue. It, uh, I thought it served the series well. There are only three episodes, but at 90 minutes each, uh, each episode covers a lot of ground. There's a lot of progress to the storyline, which is great. I find it much more gratifying to do that than to watch something for, you know, 45 minutes, which really boils down to you know, probably 32 minutes uh, without the commercials. And they're not any further ahead than when they started uh, the episode. Uh, the series does leave itself open for, for a sequel, so we'll have to see uh, what happens. I guess they're waiting uh, to hear about ratings, etc., etc. But if you're a fan of, of police procedurals and want to see something a little bit different outside of the usual New York City, Los Angeles type of milieu, uh, I definitely recommend uh, Karen Peary. As always, uh, please uh, leave your comments, let me know what you think of this series, and uh, click subscribe. Thanks for watching.